Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is brunch day. So, my friend Kipley's here and we're gonna be cooking some pancakes. Today we are gonna be trying Birch Bender's Pancake Mix. So basically, it's just paleo pancake. It says you can make pancakes or waffles. Um, and what's in here is cassava starch, organic coconut flour, almond flour, eggs, leavening agent, salt, monk fruit, and spice. I don't know what kind of spice, but we're gonna find out if these are good or not. So, today we're gonna put some blueberries, some bananas, and some cinnamon. All the instructions say here is for four inch pancakes, um, we're gonna make 12 to 14. And it says one and a half cups of mix and one and a third cup of water. But I read some reviews online and they said that you can substitute the water for almond milk and I think that that's gonna make it a little bit richer. So, that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> It's gonna be thin at first, but then you can let it sit for a couple minutes and it'll thicken. Okay, it's definitely thin. We're gonna work on it. So you can see this definitely thickened up a little bit. Um, I wouldn't say, I don't know, it's just pancake texture. Yes. I think it's supposed to be a little bit thicker than regular pancakes because um, it's not gonna fry into as much, I feel like. So I think when we put it on the pan, we're gonna make it like a little bit thicker of a pancake, maybe. We're gonna do a test one. So I think I'm gonna let it cook for like two minutes, maybe, and then we'll check. Oh, so this says grain free, but I see almonds and ingredients, so they use that a lot. Yeah, so basically a lot of paleo things will like use ca this like cassava starch, coconut flour, and almond flour are all like Suits for regular flour. Mm -hmm. And then this leavening that's in here is basically like baking soda, which will like make the rise. Wow. <laughs> We've made an executive decision to add more almond milk. So I'm gonna add about two more tablespoons of almond milk just to kind of thin it out because it's looking gritty, like literally look like grits. It's a little thick. Looking thick with two C's. Okay, so <laughs> we made one, now we're, we're gonna try it. Definitely not cooked all the way through, but the flavor is actually pretty good. It's not bad. I love it. We're gonna make some more. We thinned the batter, so cooking time should decrease. It's definitely not cooked. Oh, there's no raw egg, so it can't be that bad to cook it on. Alright, so let's see. What you got? The banana? banana? Okay, Which one? I'm going the banana too. Okay, I'm going blueberry. Okay, I don't even think this needs syrup on. Yeah. I'm gonna try it out here first. I have a big blueberry chunk in mine. It's actually pretty good. These taste better than regular pancakes to me. Really? Yeah. Wow. This is amazing. Amazing. Maybe I'm just really hungry. They're really not that sweet. Yeah. But they're like the almonds coming through, and it's kind of giving like a gritty. It's like a gritty texture. Well, you get like the natural sweetness from the fruit. Mm-hmm. It's good. It's gritty. Mm-hmm. It is a little gritty. I'm not gonna lie. I like the inside. I also wouldn't describe it as like a light, fluffy pancake. All right, so let's rate it um like one out of ten. I'm going with nine. I'm pretty damn good. I'm gonna go with nine too. Okay. I'm gonna give nine. it um, an eight and a half. Like honestly though. Okay, Simon yeah, honestly. Cow. Yeah, like I'm the Simon Cow of the group. I will say something, and that is the ones with the fruit in them do kind of have that grittier texture. But I just tried this one with the cinnamon, and it's it's got a lot different texture. So you guys Probably should try. it's cooked more. Try the plain one. Well, I just think the moisture of the fruit kind of like affects the texture. 
I love it, I love it, I love it. Yeah, I think maybe what we could do next time is like mix cinnamon mix it in into the powder. batter. Also do like cocoa powder, honestly. Yeah, that sounds good. For people interested in the caloric content of these mm, puppies. Um, so per two to three pancakes or 35 grams, who knows how much that is. Um, it's 140 calories and um, total fat is seven grams. Carbohydrates are only 16 grams. There's less than one gram of sugar and protein is seven grams. So I'm not mad about it. I don't feel bad for eating this. It says caveman approved and I think it's Katie approved. Mm -mm 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 